Things are heating up in the top end. That, 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 that's, a, that's an absolute lie. I need to address that. That's addressed. That's a factual error. Michael Gunner going head to head with country Liberal leader Leah Finocchiaro and the Territory Alliance's Terry Mills in the fiery Sky News NT election debate. I do not believe now is a time to roll the dice. The Chief Minister keen to keep the COVID response front of mind for voters ahead of this Saturday's poll, attacking the CLP for calling for the Territory's borders to reopen back in June. If you had opened those borders back in June, we would have seen community transmission of the virus here in the Northern Territory. Uh, I think that that is an absolutely disgusting thing for a Chief Minister of a jurisdiction to say. You take responsibility for your decision. You said June 22, take responsibility. The CLP leader hitting back, attacking Labor for allowing the Territory's debt to blow out to $8.2 billion. Do you now take responsibility for the debt and your recklessness when it comes to crashing our economy and burdening future generations uh, with debt levels that are unsustainable? I had to act this term to save jobs. We saw the impacts of construction phase end. We saw the need for stimulus and we acted well, from that next jobs growth. So we had to act. That's the that infrastructure what, what budget. 6.4 billion is how much we spent on infrastructure explain over the, the infrastructure. last four years. So every single thing you see built in the Northern Territory over the last four years, every road, one, every building, the Garamilla Boulevard, the, we park have park? acted to build jobs. Now, I'm not a job snob like Leah. I used to walk past that underground car park when it was being built. I used to count the jobs on that site. Five jobs today. That's five jobs that Leah would what have sacked. Those? With only two seats in the 25-seat Legislative Assembly, Ms Finocchiaro also pushed by Terry Mills on her lack of experience. Oh, Terry, I don't know if you're being ageist or just downright rude. You are the only one who has parliamentary experience in your team. We have a diverse, strong, committed, capable team of people with real-life experience in a variety of backgrounds. The former CLP Chief Minister turned Territory Alliance leader pressed on whether he will serve as a Deputy Chief Minister in a potential CLP minority government. Taking that step, that bold step, to present an alternative to both CLP and, and Labor is going to be responded to positively by the Territory community, so there are no arrangements. While Labor and the CLP are promising not to cut the public service, the Territory Alliance leader is not ruling it out. I would use the word efficiencies. I'm not here to kick the public service in the guts. The leaders have had their say. It's now up to Territory voters. Trudy McIntosh, Sky News in Darwin.